Today saint of the day of January 17th is Saint Anthony Abbott. His life was marked by solitude, fasting and work. Orphaned at 20, as a young man he gave all his goods to the poor and retired to the desert, where he also fought against the temptations of the devil, choosing the path of asceticism and prayer. Anthony was responsible for the establishment of families of monks who, under the guidance of a spiritual father, consecrated themselves to the service of God. Saint Anthony is often depicted next to a pig with a bell around its neck. This iconographic representation is linked to the fact that the ancient hospitaller order of the Antonines raised pigs because the fat of these animals was used to anoint the sick affected by ergotism. This disease was then called the fire of Sant. Antonio. On his feast day, the stalls are blessed, as are any domestic animals brought for blessing. In the iconography is associated with Saint Anthony figures also the hermit's staff in the form of T, the Tau, the last letter of the Hebrew alphabet. In the biography Vita Antoniae, Saint Athanasius wrote these words referring to Saint Anthony, that he was everywhere known, admired, and desired by everyone, even those who had not seen him, is a sign of his virtue and God-friendly soul. In fact, neither for writings nor for a profane wisdom nor for any capacity is Anthony known, but only for his piety towards God, and no one could deny that this is a gift from God. As indeed we would not have heard in Spain and in Gaul, in Rome, and in Africa of this man, who lived withdrawn in the mountains, if God himself had not made him known to all, as he does with those who belong to him, and as he had announced to Anthony since the beginning, even if Anthony acted in secret and desired to remain hidden, the Lord shows him and those like him to everyone, as a lamp, that those who hear about them know that it is possible to follow the commandments and take courage in following the path of virtue. He is a patron saint of animals, skin diseases, farmers, butchers, basket makers, brush makers, grave diggers, Pontifical Ecclesiastical Academy, Rome. Thank you for watching please like share and subscribe and bell icon.